I'm so proud of the woman that you have become. And you're not only just my sister, but you're the best friend that I've ever had. I couldn't ask for a better person to live and be with all the time. Kobe, I'm so happy that you were in Liberty's life and now ours. We always grew up with all sisters, and so did you. But now I have a brother, and I'm so happy that I do. I cannot ask for better people for each other and for the ones around me. You are going to be so happy with each other more than you already are. I love both of you and congratulations. Now I'm going to stop crying. <laughs> Hopefully. Kobe Blake Jones, you are an answered prayer. God knew what he was doing when he placed you in my life because I truly believe we were made for each other. Who knew after that first date that I would be standing here today becoming your wife? You never fail to amaze me with how generous and how loving you are to me and those around you. People talk about how difficult relationships are and I can't seem to relate. They say love is hard, but ours is the easiest, most special thing I've ever experienced. Liberty, today I stand here before you and all of our loved ones to make a vow to you, to love you, honor you, cherish you for the rest of my life. The thing I love about you the most is you've given me inner peace, and I think everyone here would agree that you bring out the best version of me. When I first met you, I knew there was something special about you. You were kind and funny and wonderful personality made me laugh. You continue to show your commitment to me every day. And today I vow to always show my dedication to our relationship and never make you second guess just how much I care about you. As time passed, I grew closer to you. I realized how special you really are to me. You mean the world to me, Liberty. These last 21 months have shown me how much I love you and I wouldn't want to spend a day without you by my side. I can't wait to grow old with you. I love you. I vow to stand by your side through it all the ups, the downs, the good, bad, and even the ugly, to laugh, cry, and grow with you. I vow to always be there for you when needed, and above all, I promise to do my best each day to love you more than I did yesterday. From your girlfriend to fiance, and now your wife. Today we've gathered together to witness the journey of Kobe and Liberty in marriage. Our God has established marriage as a symbol of Christ's perfect relationship to His body, the church. We've come together today and before Him to witness you coming together as one. Kobe, will you have this woman to be your wife, to live together in the sacred estate of marriage? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her, and be faithful only to her as long as you both shall live? I will. Liberty, will you take this man to be your husband, to live together in the sacred state of marriage? Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him, and be faithful only to him as long as you both shall be? I will. Kobe, do you take Liberty to be your wedded wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, in sorrow and in joy, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and health, to love and to cherish, till death do you part? I do. Liberty. Do you take Kobe to be your wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, in sorrow and in joy, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and health, to love and to cherish, to death? May your marriage be full of kindness, and may your years bring you happiness and contentment and forever love. Before this gathering, you have promised your love to each other, and have given each other rings to wear as a sign of your deep commitment to one another. It's my distinct pleasure that I am able to pronounce you husband and wife. Help me make kiss your brother. May I introduce to you Mr. and Miss Toby Jones.